Judy's Place for Kids is working nonstop to serve the community, but many may be unaware of how much they do. Statistics were recently gathered for the months of October through December 2023, showing all their efforts contributing toward the community. Community Outreach Coordinator Kaylin Richmond tells us more. Yeah, well, we, we try to put out a, a kind of a recap thing every quarter, um, like you said. So this, this most recent one we just put out last week was for October through December, um, you know, kind of our, our fall quarter. Um, and it, it just kind of encapsul encapsulates every, everything that each of our divisions has been working on. Um, so, you know, we've, we've had many, many forensic interviews, many advocacy sessions, many educational opportunities um, out in our schools and our community. Um, and so it just overall is just a good recap of everything that we're doing to try to prevent um, child abuse and also just bring awareness to the issue of it in our community. Norton Eye Center in Pikeville, your local vision experts. Experienced doctors using state-of-the-art technology. Choose from top designer frames from Oakley, Ray-Ban, Nike, and more. We accept Medicaid and Medicare. Plus, most insurances are accepted. Norton Eye Center in Pikeville, next to Tractor Supply. Richmond says seeing the numbers is motivation enough to continue improving the lives of others. This is because each number represents a real person and their struggles. Yeah, I mean, every time you see one of those numbers when it comes to those interviews or the, the advocacy sessions, or the medical exams, every single time you see one of those numbers that rep represents a real person and a real child that deserves, you know, the, the utmost care, right? Um, and so it's just important that we, we remember that and also our community understands that, that it's not just, you know, these aren't just numbers. These are real people that we're serving. And it's so important that we have, you know, not only our, you know, our staff's best foot forward as we serve them, but it's also important that we have the communities kind of backing behind us to make sure that we're um, just staying committed, staying um, motivated in doing that. So, Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.